a couple of hauls, a few fun chats, just sit back and relax. Online yarn sales and happy mail. Kitty cats, this and that. It's Pooh Bear's precious pumpkin patch. Welcome here. Hey there guys, it's me here, Pooh Bear 253. And of course, you are with me in Pooh Bear's precious pumpkin patch. And yes, I'm doing another voiceover. I was changing the babies here as you can see. And lately I've been enjoying just changing my babies peacefully and I will have like reborn related videos in the background catching up with you guys seeing what you guys are up to and when I run out of um, most recent videos then I start kind of watching box opening videos or reborn nursery tours and i also try to just kind of search reborn baby doll and try to find some new um reborn lovers out there that i could subscribe to um so you can see my sweet little um dason i just finished changing and actually truth be told um sorry if you guys are squeamish of doll parts, but I actually changed Aria first, but I figured it wouldn't be a great idea to start the video off with, you know, dismemberment of doll parts. But you guys can rest assured, I put some polyfill in Aria now and I tightened her zip ties. So now I can dress her without her limbs falling off because the zip ties that came with that body were kind of big anyway they're not the doll ties so i have doll ties and when i am um when it's time to get those sweet little babies changed and whatnot i will um well get them changed to get them reborn you know i'll have more doll ties so now we're working on my sweet little Viserion Zaire. He's looking so sweet. Um, I just wanted to touch bases with you guys. This video was actually filmed before the new year. This was probably filmed like on the 30th, uh, like whatever Monday was because hubby wasn't here. Um, I got six babies changed. I'm only showing you guys four of the babies that got changed and I am using those little dollar sleepers the unicorn and the um the little polar bear one to just go ahead and use those and they'll probably be in like my um they'll probably be in the um for sale pile next and I am so happy to say that I was able to sell everything um, with the exception of the 18 month stuff, I have a few 18 month things I want to see if anybody was interested in. And um, but everything else, I sold the newborn um, to zero to three month boy and girl things, and I got a nice $38.50 that I transferred into my Play Money account as of yesterday, last night. So I was super excited about that. Um, so these long pauses where you don't see me doing anything, I'm like trying to match socks and trying to find mittens there. You, you can see me there trying to match stuff because I'm just such a matchaholic. I like to have my things matchy matchy. But anyway, so, uh, me talking to you right now, it is currently the second, wait, is it? Yeah, the second. It is January 2nd, 2020. It just sounds so weird to say that 2020. It sounds so strange. Um, but um, after I finished doing this little voiceover and getting this put up, 
I will be trying to finish up my babies, uh, getting them changed out of their Christmas stuff, getting the Christmas stuff packed up and ready to roll, put it back up where it needs to go because Christmas um, for the rest of the house is like no more. And the last baby you guys are gonna see me change is this sweet little girl, my um, Persephone Serene. She's such a sweet baby girl. Um, and off camera, I got Yuri changed, Cadence changed, and Lola got changed as well. Um, oh, wait, do I have another baby I changed? Cause I, oh, no, 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 I changed him last night. And I also got um, Lucian changed as well. And I started getting Alex, Alexander changed. I just took his Christmas outfit off, but I need to get him changed. I'm going to do him when I finish uh, chatting with you guys here. So, as you guys heard in my last video, I was saying like, you know, this is the year, this new year, we're on a strict budget. And the phrase for this year is, no, you don't need that. So, that's what I'm going to be telling myself. And I plan on trying to um, take up meditation because I feel like there's like a part of me that just, you know, I think it's just kind of all of us, you kind of get that shopping bug and like that need to acquire something new. And I'm going to try to funnel that into my four times a year. My, uh, I'm allowing myself to shop four, up to four times. Um, and I'm gonna try to meditate in between those times to keep me focused and to keep me from just binging and buying stuff. So I just wanna focus this year on using the things that I have, selling the things that you know I don't really want uh, after I've used them one time. You guys can get great deals from me because I love to do my online yard sales and I sell it for little of nothing but I still get more than I would get if I took it to Once Upon a Child, in my opinion. Because $38.50 is not too bad. And pretty much everything was like, some of the stuff was like a dollar per piece, but like it probably kind of filtered down less than it because I like to sell those, you know, one stop shop type of things and I make it cheaper to make it more enticing for, pe for people to buy it. But this video is starting to wrap up. I only have a few more seconds uh, left to chat with you guys. Um, I'm going to come back and change um, a baby and chat.